what's good youtube creator house here back with another video i'm just here to show you guys how i achieved this or created this coin using hype maps and normal maps created in photoshop now this image or this design comes from a sun calendar that the aztec or the mayans i may be mistaken in mesoamerica created uh to make this uh, well to track the sun basically so i just use that as a basis for my coin nothing too serious but uh yeah let's get into it so i can see as you can see here this is the image that i have gotten and on here i just generated these height maps and the normal map so how i did this was i go up to filter go down to 3d and generate normal map there you go so as it, they automatically generate a normal map for you and normal maps are somewhat cool i guess for you to use in your displacement so you can invert the height and then you can do all kinds of stuff in here medium don't change these i i, I wouldn't change that cute see this is what i came out with and then you can do a height map as well 3d height see that and this is how i made my little height map it's it's okay inverted yeah so that's how that's pretty much how i made my height map so once you have all that completed what you're going to do is you're going to open up your blender file so let me close this and then i am going to do a general so i just made the coin like this it was very simple delete new cylinder scale on z and bam coin you can smoothen it out or whatever now then here's the part that's most important so we're going to import so we're going to import that one first and then we are going to rescale all of this that's good enough all right so i'm gonna go into my shading tab add in the image texture find out where that height thing is here is my height map shift d here's my normal map and i am going to do some changes to the world all the way down where is that light Now we're gonna go back to object. Bump. Normal into normal. Just look good. Uh, height into height. Bam. And there we go. It see that it comes off a little strong so what i'm gonna do is bring it back a little bit then there you go you have your height material and then you do whatever to get that gold uh look so let me append file append wherever your textures are there you go this is one of the gold pieces, gold materials that I have uh, done or fixed. Roughness. And then I just gotta change the lighting. Where is my light? I uh, added a HDRI image. Let's see. This is something I found on this uh, online. This is photo surface. Bam. Cause so, HDRIs are really cool. They really help get the look you're looking for. But for my last animation, I just added a bunch of rigid bodies to the 
the parts to get that uh falling effect <laughs> black speculate oh my God. that seems pretty cool if you ask me definitely need to work on a little bit more of my lighting so it looks better As you can see, that with the HDRI changes when you move it a little bit. But yeah, that's how you get that. Uh, that's how you use Photoshop textures, Photoshop to help make your height maps and stuff in for Blender. I personally think it's pretty cool to be able to do all that roughness all the way up. Looks like sand. Don't want that. All kinds of stuff. So that's how you get that. That uh, that's how you use those displacements for your thing. If you got a better way to do a go, please let me know. Cause I am curious. I want to see how you guys do it. Let's see, like, see how this. Change it a little bit. Make it a little, a little more rough. Everything. But that's how you guys do that. That's how you get the little gold coin. If you like what I did or like what I saw, make sure you subscribe or hit the notification thing. And catch you guys next video. Peace.